Hi everybody, this is Bupin the Tube. Welcome to my channel. Today I want to show you how to display the margin or to make sure that the margin is shown on your paper space in your layout. You can see in layout 3 it doesn't show the margin and if you go to layout 2 it does show. So what you need to do to fix it is to go to the plot. Then in the plot uh, you can see I have selected AutoCAD PDF but that, that doesn't matter it can be any printer you want or plotter you want and have a note of the size ISO full blend A4 okay then what we need to do is to go to the properties of that printer any printer doesn't matter it can be inches or millimeter that also doesn't matter so here we need to go to modify standard paper sizes because that's what we selected and as I said uh, you need to make a note of the size you selected. You can also make this bigger by stretching it, uh, stretching here to make it easier to view. By default, it might not be easy. Then you need to go to ISO Full Blend A4 for this example. ISO Full Blend A4. So we need to scroll a bit down. ISO Full Blend A4 everything matches then we need to click on modify you can see here obviously the reason why the margin was not showing because the margin is set to zero so let's for this example set any value just to show you the trick so i set it to five millimeter it gives you a preview now here and then you press next you can give it a name uh, custom file name if the file exists it might give you a warning you can just for this example give one then finish and now we are okay and you can save it or you can apply it to the current plot you say okay apply it to the current plot and now you can apply it to the layout it doesn't necessarily need to do that but if you just say okay no sorry if you just say cancel you can see the margin is now showing on this layout as well so when you move your viewpoint you show sure you're not going to go out of the layout it's as simple as that how to sh change your margin or make sure that the margin is displayed i hope this video was useful i have lots of other tutorials on AutoCAD. you can find the uh, the playlist of my tutorials in the description of this video thanks for watching